this is Miss Shorier, and today I'm going to be reading you a book called Excellent Ed. This book is by Stacy Minoki, illustrated by Julia Sarcone Roach. That means Miss Julia drew the pictures. This book is a 3.1 level, and the quiz number is 183153. Now we'll go back at the end and tell you the quiz number again. Excellent Ed. All the Ellis children were excellent at something, except Ed. All the Ellis children were allowed to eat at the table and to ride in the van and sit on the couch and use the indoor bathroom. Elaine was an excellent soccer player. Ed pretended to carry the ball in his mouth. The twins, Emily and Elmer, were excellent at math, and they could add faster than a calculator. Ed could only count to four. Edith was an excellent ballerina, and she could twirl on her toes. Ed could twirl, too, but it just wasn't the same. Ernie baked excellent cupcakes, and Ed agreed. Look, he's down here eating one of the cupcakes. Maybe if I was excellent, like Elaine, Emily, Elmer, Edith, and Ernie, then I could eat at the table and ride in the van and sit on the couch and use the indoor bathroom, Ed thought. But what was Ed excellent at? Then he got it, breaking stuff. I'm definitely excellent at breaking stuff. Ed thought that should earn him a place at the Ellis family table. Do any of you have a dog that breaks stuff? Maybe if it's a puppy, it does. But before he could jump onto a chair, oh, I skipped a page, sorry. But before he could jump onto a chair, Elaine zoomed in the kitchen and yelled, I broke the record for most soccer goals in a season. Oh, Elaine was better than breaking stuff than Ed. I must be excellent at something, Ed thought. Then he got it, losing stuff. Just last week, he lost himself when he wandered out in the backyard. I'm definitely excellent at losing stuff. Hmm, Ed was thinking. Ed thought that'd earn him a ride in the van, but just as he was about to jump in, Elmer shouted, I lost my tooth, I lost my tooth. Me too, Emily said. Elmer and Emily were better at losing stuff than Ed because they lost their tooth. I must be excellent at something, Ed thought. Better than Elaine, Emily, Elmer, Edith, and Ernie. But what? Forgetting stuff. That's like me. He always forgot to wipe his paws. And he forgot that he shouldn't water the rose bushes. Know what that means. And he always seemed to forget that he had just eaten. Ed, you just ate, Dad said. I'm definitely excellent at forgetting stuff, Ed thought. He was sure that earned him a nap on the couch. But then Edith came running in and made an announcement. What do you think she's going to have forgot? I'm the new lead ballerina. When I auditioned, I forgot to be nervous, and I danced my best ever. Ed whimpered. He wasn't even the best forgetter. Maybe I'm not excellent enough to be part of the Ellis family. <clears throat> Just then, Ernie dropped half of his peanut butter sandwich, and Ed gobbled it up. Wow, Ed. You're excellent at cleaning the floor, Ernie said. Yeah, I am an excellent floor cleaner, floor cleaner. Maybe that's why I don't eat at the table. Then Emily and Elmer walked in the front door. Ed jumped up and covered them with kisses. Ed, you're excellent at welcoming us home, Emily and Elmer said. Yeah, I'm an excellent welcomer. Maybe that's why I don't go away in the van. 
He just stays at home and welcomes them when they get home. Do you have a dog that does that? My dogs, they like to lick me when I get home. Later, the family squished together on the couch and there was no room for Ed, so he lay across Edith and Elaine's feet. Ed is excellent at warming feet, Elaine whispered to Edith. Yeah, I'm an excellent feet warmer. Maybe that's why they don't let me sit on the couch. Maybe they got cold feet. Ed wagged his tail. He was an excellent Ellis after all. Now, if he could just figure out why he wasn't allowed to use that indoor restroom. Boys and girls, I bet you're all excellent at something. We all are excellent at something. I'm excellent at losing my glasses and losing my pen for my board. And but you all know that. You have to help me find it every day, don't you? So the name of the book was Excellent Ed. And the quiz number is 183153. Hope you enjoyed this story about Excellent Ed. Guess what I want you to do? Go and be excellent. Goodbye.